That's right, Pip. It's a kind of strange atmosphere, isn't it? Because we've had all these little points in the roadmap where people have got quite excited and now we're hurtling towards Freedom Day at a rapid rate and actually people are just feeling more anxious than ever. It's perhaps understandable when you look at the figures here in Yorkshire and, of course, in the North East as well. Uh, actually, case rates are higher than they've been since last summer. And also, uh, the rules are being lifted, but the actual advice is pretty much the same. So we're just having to decide whether we wear masks and that sort of thing. You might actually see some of the bars, cafes, Cafes, restaurants where you live saying we are going to still make you wear uh, masks and we're not going to let you come up to the bar so a lot of pressure on everybody uh, so we conducted this poll with YouGov it found that surprisingly is the young people uh, so NHS England are trying to combat this by making it really easy to get a jab so there will be pop-ups in places like the Trinity Centre behind me uh, and also in a Primark in Bristol so people can get a jumpsuit and a jab uh, making it as easy as they possibly can uh, because perhaps young people shouldn't be resting on their laurels according to SAGE experts. Yeah. So Freedom Day is almost upon us, but how literally you interpret that is really up to the individual. Absolutely, Katie, thank you.